below your course learning outcomes, you can add the requirements for taking your course. A requirement that is pretty much standard for all online courses is the desire to learn. If there are more requirements for taking your course, you can add those here. For example, a certain level of knowledge or experience in a certain topic. Although the best courses are those that take students from a beginner level to an advanced level. Underneath the requirements is the intended learners. So this is anyone and everyone who will benefit from taking your course. For example, here, this is a body language course and it can benefit entrepreneurs, salesmen, police officers to identify uh, uh, criminals, employees of all occupations, parents uh, to see when their kids are telling the truth or lying, um, anyone who wants to communicate more effectively and people who want to find the right person. So you want to list your intended learners individually here. Anyone who will benefit from taking your course, you list them here. Obviously, no course is for everybody. That's why you should identify your intended learners and list them here so that it's clear who your course is intended for.